Yo, what's cracking guys? It's Jared Vicious. And after getting that new update on our Evo 4Gs, we can't go out, you know, without checking out some benchmark tests. So let's do some uh, benchmarking. So let's check out frames per second 2D. See what it gives us. And if you guys saw the what I got before, it was about 28 and now I'm getting 52. So pretty good. I'm satisfied and impressed. Alright, the next test we're going to run is the Limpack. And let's check this out. It's getting 30 and some change. 35. Twenty four, so it's okay. I mean, I think before I was getting higher numbers, but as long as it's in the thirties. All right, next test, Neocore. Let's run this. So 27.3 frames per second. All right, next test, we'll do the infamous quadrant. And there we are, we are right underneath the Nexus 1. And the last test we're going to do is we're going to run Nina Mark. And this is another GPU uh, benchmark. So.
Well. Well. So, those are the benchmark tests after the update. And I'd like to know how you guys did. Like, what are your guys' results? Do you think this is a great update or not? Um, so far, um, it looks great swiping through home screens and apps and running 2D applications, but just our 3D uh, side of the Evo isn't all that great compared to, like, let's say, a Galaxy S phone. But I don't know, maybe it's just my phone, but. Let me know how you guys are doing with the update and you know just hit me up with a comment you know subscribe also and email if you have any questions i'm going to keep running more tests and maybe if i get better results i'll update you guys with it and until next time catch you guys later peace